Welcome, Anthony Strong. Um, you're a main artist for Smooth FM, so it's a big pleasure to have you here. Thank you so much for, the, for inviting me. This is your first time in Portugal. You come to present your new album, Stepping Out, a mix of originals and standards from yes. the American songbook. Was it easy to choose these classics? I mean, yeah, for me, I love uh, so many different types of music. It's a real challenge when I'm putting together an album to find songs that um, sound coherent, that make sense in, a, in, in terms of a whole album. So, uh, yes, it's, it's, it is quite challenging, but, uh, but part of the fun as well. I enjoy it. The way you approach and uh, twist the old songs uh, sounds so fresh and new. Um, they almost sound like pop songs. Are you a jazz or a pop musician oh, or both? That's a secret, yeah. Um, <laughs> I, I love jazz music. I, 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 I studied jazz when I was at music college in London. Uh, so jazz is always going to be a big part of what I do. Um, but I wouldn't say that I'm a jazz musician because having studied at music college, I know that, 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 that jazz goes uh, much further than what I'm doing. What I'm doing is, is playing pop music and using jazz uh, to sprinkle a little magic on the top, I think. Um, mostly pop with a little jazz, that's the way I describe it. Okay. I read somewhere that you are England's new jazz superstar. Mm. Um, that your music is a fantastic retro contemporary jazz. Everybody compares you to Michael Bublé and also your friend Jamie Cullum. Yeah. What do you feel about it? Uh, I mean, I, I love Jamie and I, I think Michael's, Michael Bublé is a great singer as well, a great artist, both of them. So for me, I'm, I'm very flattered, you know. Um, I think I'm quite different. I would mm -hmm. say I'm more like Harry Connick Jr. I'm, I'm a more of a, I see myself as a, first and foremost a musician. Uh, and an entertainer rather than uh, just a singer um, and in my band I write all the arrangements and I, I'm the musical director and I, I do everything you know um, so I see myself more than just the, the guy who sing, sings on front of the, in front of the stage in front of the band uh, but no I love both those artists so whenever anyone mentions Jamie or Michael and my name in the same sentence I'm only flattered <laughs> Let's talk about tonight's show. Um, three musicians on stage, a special guest. Three musicians yes. with me in, in my band, yeah, bass, uh, bass, drums and sax, and then me on piano and, and singing. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, we have a very special special guest uh, from uh, Portugal, uh, Oreia, is going to uh, yes. be joining oh, me yeah. on stage for a couple of songs. So I'm very excited about that. Um, but also very excited about playing this venue because I hear really special things about this venue. Good. <laughs> well, it's going to be a kind of soul and jazz fusion uh, tonight? Or? Yeah, so we'll be playing lots of songs from my album Stepping Out and some of my uh, older music as well from uh, previous albums. A couple of surprises and obviously we'll, Aurea will be singing uh, maybe one of her songs and she might sing one of my songs, but yeah. I don't want to tell too much, okay. give too much away. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what do you have on, or, on your iPod? Wow. Um, <laughs> Well, I have a lot of jazz, I have a lot of jazz music, but I also have a lot of sort of um, hip hop music and a lot of soul music, so a lot of Motown. It's a real mixed bag. I have some classical music on there. Um, I don't have my full library on my iPod. I just have my sort of what I carry around with me, which is, uh, you know, a bit of Diana Krall, a bit of Jamie Cullum, uh, who else do I listen to? Elvis Costello, Burt Bacharach, Stevie Wonder, uh, Aretha Franklin, Ella Fitzgerald, loads of different people. <laughs> I could go on for hours. <laughs> you are touring tonight to Lisboa and then? Uh, and then to... I go home for a few days and then I'm, I'm recording my new album at the moment as well. Mm -hmm. So I was in the studio uh, for the last two days and then um, a really early start to come to Lisbon today. Mm -hmm. uh, so I'm back in the studio for a little bit and then I think I uh, have uh, some gigs in Norway and then we go to Borneo um, in, um, near Malaysia. Uh, and then the US. So it's a busy year, yeah. but uh, an exciting so, year. Do you plan to take over the world? That is the plan, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Catch up with Michael Bublé, that's the plan. <laughs> We're nearly there. Thank you so much for this moment. It's a pleasure um, to be here. I'll see you later on CCB after the sound check. Great. To talk again with you and um, with Aurea also. 
Fantastic. We'll see you then. Thank you. Cheers. Smooth FM and all that jazz.